So I'm back again, guys. This is Zim Project. We are there in Wange, and I'm here to show you, to showcase what's happening in Zimbabwe. You know, this is a mega project happening in Zimbabwe, and we just want to applaud the government for doing such things. But here, I'm standing, you know, uh, in the background. What you're seeing is the old uh, plant, the old, uh, you know, uh, project by ZPC. That's why my gates are unique. Nobody will my gates are but guys. Magita Uto Nesa Fonia go to one up on a last junior Takashila Takashila Pazin project. Aruba. So I urge you to subscribe to the, to the channel. I urge you to subscribe to my channel because Magita Uto to connect to Wi Fi. Aruba. <laughs> so, guys, you know, please subscribe to the channel. This is the general one, the project where the electricity uh, was produced, but this. And now the new activities happening. I think you are seeing what's happening. I've been moving uh, with my brother Jerry and we have been showing you uh, some of the activities happening. This is the new project, uh, the famous Wange expansion project. So we are there to make sure that you guys are inspired. You are there to make sure uh, that uh, even some of the guys who want to come to do uh, civil engineering, to do electronics engineering, to do electrical engineering. We are there to inspire you. These are big projects happening in Zimbabwe. It is one of the mega projects happening in Zimbabwe. And we just want to applaud, you know, uh, all the responsible guys who are working on this ZPC, the government. We want to applaud them because we know that uh, these are the children uh, from Zimbabwe who are involved in this project. I'm sure you've heard the engineer saying, ah, I've been doing this, I've been pushing this, I've been doing all these columns. This. You know, it is Zimbabwean engineers. This is Vance Junior. Chica, 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 chica. Wangi expansion project. We are there. Uh, we are trying by all means to showcase real things that are happening on the ground. Zimbabwe is under construction. Zimbabwe is developing. We believe that uh, Zimbabwe is going far. So today we are going to be covering the famous Wange expansion project. I think you're seeing what's happening there. That's the mega cooling tower. The biggest cooling tower so far here, which has been constructed by Team Sino Hydro. And those are some of the structures that you're seeing in the background uh, that have been constructed. And all those retaining walls uh, that are under construction to make sure that uh, this project becomes a success. So we are here at Wange. We will continue to move uh, to various uh, mega projects here in Zimbabwe, making sure that uh, we cover everything concerning the mega projects in Zimbabwe, hoping that you're going to be inspired by these activities happening in Zimbabwe. This is Zim Projects here in Wange, Matabele North. Yeah, so we are now at the weighing bridge uh, where all the uh, the loads uh, they pass through, and uh, these are some of the behind the scenes that are happening at the Wange expansion project. So we are now at the way bridge. We are now at the way bridge. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right, all right. So that's the scale. So you know where you want to speak down there. All right. Yeah, good up with those right there. Okay. Those are the way you want. And then this is the track safety. All right. All right. Quality is is it like the quality? Okay, okay. All right. So in short, he's saying this driller, uh, it will collect the coal uh, from the lorries that to be coming from the way bridge, and uh, it's, uh, the, the, it's it's then sent to the quality control room, where they will check the quality of the coal. So yeah, it proceeds to the to the coal site. Alright. Then 
So these are sprinklers to cool down the. Yeah, to cool down the coal, like during the hot days. During the hot days. The coal is very flammable, so these sprinklers are there to just cool. Down, yeah. Because if they don't cool it, you know, not hang out of here. Not of here. Yeah. So that's a reclaimer which is taking the the coal. To the conveyor belt. Yes, this is them. Like you see, this core right now, it's not enough. It's supposed to be in the same level with that. Okay. That, with those caps, right there. So they are going to feed until this, until the core reaches the that level. All right. Okay. So that the caps will be just like scooping, so scooping, putting on the conveyor, scooping, putting on the conveyor. See, like that conveyor. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay, guys, there are some of the aspects that I just want to, you know, put light on. When you see things like this, it's not just a jura hole. A lot of people, they think, ah, it's just a jura hole, it's just a jura hole, a small thing that they... No, guys, the engineering works that, that uh, happened here. This is called the retaining wall. And uh, we actually did how it's done, how it's worked on, on the other modules that we did there. So this is a retaining wall and uh, uh, this is now a courtyard. So how deep is this uh, retaining wall generally? Mm, so firstly we did a fusion. Okay. 15 meters cooled blind. Okay. After that we did another uh, 75 centimeters. All right. Of a cooled blind as well. All right. The reinforcement. Yeah. Then after that we did another 50 centimeters. I think if you, if you look there, yes. it's still out, it's not yet the key. All right. Right there. All right. There is a 50 centimeter uh, footing there. All right. Footing. So if you add the 75, then you add the 50 centimeter, it's almost one meter something. And then this is 1.5 meter. All right. So basically, it's not just the, the, the wall that you are seeing. Yeah. There's some engineering that we done downside. All right. So you are saying when people see such things, they don't have to take it as a general war or a general war. Yeah, it's not a general war. <laughs> well, it is designed so that it doesn't topple. All right. When the core is now filled inside. Okay. It doesn't. All right. It doesn't move, shift. It is designed so that it will sustain each and every force. All right. Either a track is supposed to maybe a track hits the wall. Oh, yeah. It's supposed to sustain. All right. Yeah. So these are some of the engineering works that uh, we uh, we are appreciating here. And uh, Zin Projects is there to showcase engineering techniques, engineering. You know, like it's not like we are just doing journalism. We want to appreciate the engineering side. So engineer, you were telling me about uh, these uh, this this chimney. Yeah. You said uh, gone are the days where they where they, where they are using all those chimneys. They saw it not that much necessary. They came uh, to a conclusion that they want to do one chimney. Yeah, there's no need to, to build three or four chimneys right there. All right. Because yeah. this one is for this project. They don't want it to emit too much, too much uh, carbon dioxide or carbon dioxide. This is that one is uh, emitting right. so much gases. All right. So they decided to use this one chimney, which is supposed to filter. All those, those gases, all right. so that when it goes to the atmosphere, it will need to be framed to the environment. Also, they are using a uh, technique. Yeah, they are using this FGD to FGD. Yes, flue gas desulfurization. All right, all right, all right, yeah. all right, all right. They are using that FGD to convert even from the ashes, because like as you see, some of the days the ashes, the ashes are, are sprinkled in the atmosphere. All right. But uh, for this project, they are saying no, the ashes. They want to use it for other purposes, like they want to make gypsum. All right. They want to make limestone. All right. So gypsum is used as a fertilizer. Okay. As you know. Yes, so, in the agro elite business. Exactly. <laughs> so that building right there, that structure, that that whole warehouse there, uh -huh. is, that's where the gypsum will be stored. All right. In the downside, there is also a, a retaining wall that was done okay. for, for for the limestone storage. Right. So they are actually planning to, 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 to manufacture limestone here. They are plan, planning to manufacture gypsum here. Okay. From the product of coal. Right. Like after the coal is burned, the ashes now. 
All right. They are mixed with some chemicals. I don't know the, the chemicals. All right. But the final product, the byproduct of coal, they are saying they are producing gypsum, gypsum and limestone. limestone. Yeah, so this is uh, the, one of the major uh, projects happening in the southern, uh, southern African region. And we're hearing that uh, uh, there are things that are going to, to, to be manufactured from this plant. Uh, one of the days where we are seeing, uh, you know, all those carbon dioxide being emitted uh, without any treatment or any forms of reducing the emission of carbon dioxide. So this facility, they are using flue gas uh, desulfurization, uh, whereby the other things they are removed from the, you know, uh, such as sulfur. Such sulfur. as sulfur. We know sulfur is a toxic gas. Yes, yes, yes. I think so you are hearing the, 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 the word desulfur. De Okay, yeah, so they are removing sulfur and um, yeah, we are there to make sure that uh, we show these things to you guys. So fertilizer is going to be manufactured from this place. They are going to use all those, uh, you know, chemicals that are going to be produced from this chimney to come up with fertilizer. There is limestone and also uh, there is gypsum, which is going to be produced from this site, which was not happening from that the old, old site, part. the old site. They're also planning to manufacture cement here. You know, like this, I don't know how they do it, but the, the cement, cement, cement that you see there, yeah. it is mixed with ash, yes. with fly ash, yeah. so that they, they don't use the raw cement, like, so that they, they of which, use... Of which the limestone and the uh, gypsum that you're talking about, those are some of the things that are put for the manufacture of cement, right? Okay. Wow, this is massive and so this is interesting. We only not have tips okay. to, to produce cement. Yeah. They are going to produce cement here. Okay. At the same time, there is electricity. Yeah. So, we got to appreciate this guy. Yeah, we have to appreciate. We have to appreciate. We have to appreciate. So, those guys who are willing to uh, support the initiative by Zim Projects uh, to move around the country, uh, making sure that uh, we showcase what's happening in the country, please. Uh, you can contact us uh, on the numbers uh, given below and you tell us how you want to work with us so that uh, we continue doing this thing whereby we are talking with engineers, they are technocrats, they are telling us the real things happening. All right. Also, when they are done with uh, this uh, project, this project that you are seeing, the, the unit 7 and 8, they will then go to, uh, to the other units the, which are currently functioning and they will surface it. I'm sure they will be working on, uh, you know, all those uh, FGDs and uh, making sure that uh, uh, the gases emitted are not causing that much harm to the society. Because we have been working, uh, I'm sure that you have seen our president uh, attending uh, programs like, uh, you know, world climatic change. So these are some of the things that we are looking, looking into. It's very crucial. Uh, we respect the climate and that's why they have uh, come to a conclusion that they want to come up with the flu gas desulfurization whereby they are removing any effects that may come uh, with uh, the gases emitted. So we just want to thank the government, the stress by the government to make sure that these things exist. My brother, Chijiruiti Yeah, so this is the famous FGD that we were talking about. Yes. Yeah, this was this was one. This one was actually constructed by the famous Robin. If you know Robin, okay, and Marvin. Yeah, Marvin. You know Marvin. Yes, Robin and, and, and Marvin. Marvin. Yeah. So these are the guys who worked so, on this massive uh, FGD. Exactly. Yes, yes. Robin and Marvin. And this is this 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 retaining wall now. Yeah. That's where the limestone is going to be stored. Okay. Yeah. Well, so the, 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 the retaining wall is where the limestone is going to be stored. Exactly. Yeah, same and the, the same as that, uh, same as that the, that building there, that's where the gypsum, gypsum is going to be stored. Exactly. That's massive. Yeah. That's massive. So these silver pipes, these silver and green pipes. Yes. That's where all the the, the cables. Yes. Everything, the cables, the water pipes. So that these red pipes that we are seeing right there, yeah. these are the water pipes so that when there is a fire, yes, they will just quench the fire All right. using these. Yeah, so those are the, 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 the water for fire, you know, when there is a fire that's happening. Uh -huh. All right. So what's happening there, I'm seeing that building, there seems like they are putting some forms, those the cushions. Oh, right there. Yeah. Like, uh, as you know, this is going to be... This is, this is a thermal power station. Yes. There is a 
team yes that is going to turn the turbine yes so that team if this building will be very hot yes as you know like the the fire is the core is burning the water yes. and the water the water turns into steam yes the steam now turns the steam. so the, basically this whole area is, is covered in those all right pieces. they're insulating yeah. it yeah they're insulating so that people working there they won't feel energy in any temperature changes yes wow that's massive yeah that's they're massive insulating it so that people working there they won't feel any changes at all because it will be very hot it will be very hot very hot because the steam will be what and it will be on, on high pressure yes so that it turns the the the, 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 the temperature. Temperature. yeah so yeah guys uh, this this is the thing that i've been uh, emphasizing that zim projects is there to bring you technical things that are happening in construction even in mining we are going to visit any construction activity happening in zimbabwe we're going to visit there and make sure that we showcase i'm sure you want to be inspired by these big buildings but we as engineers we look at technical things happening. That's why you see had the guy talking about uh, retaining walls. He's talking about insulation. He's talking about uh, a lot of things, uh, FGD and everything. This is uh, Lance Junior here in uh, Wange, Takachila.